हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल इंजीनियर्स एकेडमी काइंडली सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल इफ़ यू हैवेंट सब्सक्राइब इट येट नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम विच सेज दैट लोकेट द सेंट्राइट वाई बार ऑफ द एरिया सो वी हैव टू फाइंड द लोकेशन ऑफ द सेंट्राइट ऑफ दिस शेड एरिया फ्राम द एक्स एक्सिस सो नाउ फॉर दैट वी नो दैट वाई बार इज इक्वल टू वाई टेल द टाइम्स डी ए divided by the integral of da so to evaluate this equation we need to define our differential area so let's say that uh, this is my differential area and its height is given by y this is y so whatever the y value at this particular instance is that that will be the height of this differential area and similarly its width is its width is dx so now we can say that uh, da is uh, y times dx and this profile y is given as a function of x so we can write that da is x to the power 2 divided by 3 dx so now we can uh, evaluate this integral so this will be da and this is x to the power 2 divided by 3 dx and we need to integrate this so the integration need to be from x equals to 0 until x equals to 8 inches so we need to add up all the areas of all the differential strips from x equals to 0 until x equals to 8 inches so the integration is from 0 to 8 so this will give us the total area so this is when we integrate this so this is x 2 divided by 3 plus 1 so 2 divided by 3 plus 1 is uh, 5 divided by 3 and divided by 5 divided by 3 so we can write this as 3 divided by 5 and this is from 0 to 8 so this will be 3 divided by 5 8 to the power 5 divided by 3 minus 0 to the power 5 divided by 3 so this will become 0 so we are left with 3 divided by 5 3 divided by 5 multiply by 8 to the power 5 divided by 3 so this gives me 19.2 the area is 19.2 inch square since these units are given in these lengths are given in inches so the area is 19.2 inch square now we can find this integral as well this y tilde times da so y tilde is the location of the centroid of uh, this differential strip from the x axis so this is y tilde this height is y tilde and from the height of the strips we can say that uh, this y tilde will be equal to half of the height of this differential strip so y tilde is y divided by 2 So now I can write that this y tilde is y divided by 2 and da in terms of y is y dx divided by that integral da which is 19.2 So now if I multiply this so this will become y square divided by 2 or we can write it as y square divided by 2 into 19.2 So now we can write this as 2 into 19.2 is 38.4. So we can write that this is y square divided by 38.4. So now we can write it as uh, 1 divided by 38.4 and y square dx. And now we are given this y as a function of x so y is equal to x to the power 2 divided by 3 so we can find y square so this will become x to the power 4 divided by 3 so now this is we can replace this y square this is y square so we can write it as uh, 1 divided by 38.4 and y square is x to the power 4 divided by 3 dx and again we need to integrate this from 0 x equals to 0 until x equals to 8 inches so this is 1 divided by 38.4 
and when we integrate this so this will be uh, 4 divided by 3 plus 1 4 divided by 3 plus 1 so this will give us 7 divided by 3 divided by 7 divided by 3 and this is from 0 to 8 or we can write it as 3 divided by 7 so this is we can write it as 3 divided by 7 into 38.4 and if I put these limits so this will be 8 to the power 7 divided by 3 minus 0 to the power 7 divided by 3 so this will become 0 so we will be left with this thing right so this is we can write it as 3 into 8 to the power 7 divided by 3 divided by 7 into 38.4 this gives me 10 divided by 7 so which is 1.43 approximately so y bar is 1.43 inches so now this means that the uh, the centroid of this blue shaded area is located at a distance of 1.43 meters from the x axis is so let's say that let's say that this line is at a distance of 1.43 this height of this line or the location of this line from the x axis is 1.43 inches so the centroid of this blue shaded area is located on this line and that will be somewhere here so this is the solution of this particular problem i hope uh, you people would have understood this problem solution uh, kindly subscribe my channel for the solution of such more problems also like this video if it helps in your learning